My name is Jian Galang. I'm an artist and illustrator based in New York. Most of my work focuses on the figure in motion. I do a lot of work involving martial arts, athletes, and action figures for brands like the UFC, Reebok, and Nike. And I've recently been working in the fine art and pop culture worlds. Like a lot of kids, the Ninja Turtles were my first introduction to everything cool. Martial arts, pizza, nunchucks, skateboarding, and cool catchphrases, and they were everywhere. The toys were cool, the cartoons were cool, the movies were cool, and I think what made them so iconic was how unique they were. They, their look was so bold and original, especially compared to other action heroes at the time who were all human-based, you know, Batman, Superman, and all the comic book and movie action stars. The turtles were weird, bright colored mutants with ninja moves and were kind of wacky and fun. So I think all of these elements combined to create these perfect icons that continue to be so memorable. I had so many ideas for this project because of the built in fandom and nostalgia. But in the end, I wanted to accomplish three things. I wanted to strike the balance of fun loving and badass. I feel like that's a key characteristic of the turtles and a big part of what makes them so unique among other action heroes. So I thought it would be fun to incorporate skate poses in all of the compositions alongside a martial arts pose. Having these two poses in each composition allowed me to play with the unique skate body language and dynamism while creating a cool juxtaposition with the martial arts poses. It also added that Ninja Turtle element of fun. Next, I wanted to make them bold and graphic. I think the turtles resonated with so many kids because on a visual level, they were so bold and graphic. From the character design and colorful masks to the wild weapons and accessories and the cartoons and toy lines. So I wanted to stick with solid, bold colors for the artwork and really emphasize the texture and shapes. And lastly, I wanted it to feel a little street. I think. Part of their cool factor was the fact that they literally lived underground and skated in sewers and popped out of manholes. So I painted some of the turtle catchphrases in bright colors in a bit of street style and collaged them into the final artwork. My favorite turtle is Michelangelo uh, because my full name is Gianangelo or Gian Angelo. I don't know why mom, my mom gave me an Italian name you know, like the Ninja Turtles, but um, me and Mikey share half of a name, so I had to go with him when I was a kid. But I, I admittedly, I did feel a little bit more of a connection with Raph. I felt like he was a little bit more of a loner, a little bit more badass, trained a little more, so um, I felt a little bit more of a connection there. <laughs>